Welcome to Seashorn Vlog. And we're a cracker barrel. We are. It's, I've been here before once. It was really, really good, but I thought you needed to come along with me. You did. Yes, and also our friends, of course. We're going to head in and look around the country store, which is very, very good, and get some food. Sounds like a plan. But first, the rocking chair. You're rock, rock, rocking in your rocking chair. Yes. We're checking out the shop first. Because there's lots of Southern American stuff. And of, food and a, drink. There's a lot of stuff. NASA. That's a nice t-shirt. It is. Mm. Encouragement. Sloth. <laughs> Oh. That is heavy. You're not Can't take that home. You're not getting that on a plane. That's half the half the luggage allowance. Yeah. I'm sexy and I'm always. <laughs> I don't. No, you don't. We don't have worse. grass at home. No. Ooh, you want yeah. all these old-fashioned old drinks? It's this one, black cherry. Black cherry. That's your cup of tea. Yeah. Dad's cream soda. Virgil's cane sugar vanilla cream soda. That would be yeah. nice. Whirly pop. Whirly pop. Rainbow fruit punch. Cotton candy. Uh huh. Yeah. You get that Jones one at home, I'm sure. Oh, I just bought. I just spent twice that in the shop for one of these. <laughs> these are really good. I had them last time. The Goo Goo clusters. Might get some of them. Moon pies. You want toys? Daddy wants a hug. Look at these. Uh -huh. They might be good. They might be. Crunchy butter topped peanuts with a maple coating. Yep. This is fabulous. Fourth of July ready right here. We have got our table. I don't like the theming of this restaurant. It's very good. <laughs> you do or don't? I do. Oh, okay. This is the menu for Cracker Barrel, and it's got a lot of choices. You're gonna love it. Thank you, Diane. You're welcome. Uh, so you've got different daily specials every day, early dinner deals, breakfast. You can have breakfast all day in Cracker Barrel, which is why Chewie's getting two pancakes, not three. <laughs> uh, you get, there's also the favourite. There's samplers, signature chicken. The chicken's really good here. You've got home cooked classics. I'm going for the chicken pot pie. And then there's all the sides. And then you've got the drinks, but they don't have any peach ice, peach tea, which is unfortunate for me, because that's what I wanted. And then drinks. It's good too. It's really good, isn't it? Yeah. I only had it once. Our friends are here. You start with biscuits and cornbread and jams. The Dr. Pepper is not very good, just saying that. I'm having a biscuit and it's really warm and soft and fluffy. Need some salted butter. And it's just melting, it's so warm, Caroline. It's just so warm and melty and oh. Any good? Yeah. Oh no, you don't like butter, but you should. And Natalie's been fighting everybody for the cornbread. Yeah, because it was one cornbread muffin and I fought everybody for the one in the basket. <laughs> Wait, you don't like butter? Yeah. Yeah. I can't stand butter or margarine. It's not normal. No. I don't Did like your mom drop you on your head? I don't particularly like chocolate either, Diane. He I've got no... I hate chocolate, but I do like white chocolate. The weird thing is chocolate. I can have a little bit of white and I can have a bit of dark chocolate, but I'm not a big fan of chocolate and I'm not a big fan okay. of puddings either, but give me chips as in but British crisps I will eat till the cows come home. I, I like Mexican them. chocolate. Yeah. yeah. I like Mexican dark chocolate. I like a cacao. All of our foods have arrived. I went for the chicken pot pie. I'll come back and try that in a second. Caroline's went for vegetable soup. Natalie you've got roast beef. Roast 
beans. Mashed potato and green beans. Yummy. And has chicken and dumplings. There's some pancakes looking good over there and a cheeseburger. And you've got lots of fried food. <laughs> chicken. Chicken shrimp. tenders. I think there's shrimp and, and steak tips. Yeah, they're, mm. yeah, yeah, they don't look great to be fair. No. Okay, let's try a bit of this chicken pot pie. That looks good actually. Actually, yeah, that's that's what it looks like inside. You like pot pie, don't you? Yeah. I think that's the first time we met you. We eat pot pie, is that right? In Disney. Where would I have gotten it? Yes. Very hot, full of flavour. Okay, you can now eat your soup with your tiny spoon. That was dirty. Soup's nice but cold. Probably because you made an age fresh spoon. Yeah. That is a tiny spoon. Like that is a tiny spoon. I think everyone's mostly finished with their food. Mine was, was okay. Your soup, there's still lots of it. Natalie's polished hers off. And yours. My doesn't... favorite part was the uh, hash brown <laughs> The hash browns. Yeah. Pancakes, too doughy and not, sell, not selling cracker barrel here. The burger. <laughs> and the best thing about mine was the mashed potatoes and gravy. That's just, this isn't a good review. Here is our bill for mine and Caroline's for the chicken pot pie and the soup and the Coke Zero and the Dr. Pepper. 24.87 uh, plus tip. So we're gonna pay for this in the shop and then we'll leave our final thoughts. Time for the review with just me and you. Yeah. My food was okay. My Dr. Pepper was awful. Your soup my had soup too much was, sweet corn in for you, which my is soup was personal choice. It came cold. It had too much sweet corn for me and too many um, peas because I'm not a big fan of garden peas. They gave you a baby spoon to they eat it. They gave me a baby spoon to eat it, which was hard anyway. Which um, we had to, sh like, nobody was coming to the, we were sat there for about 10 minutes. Nobody yeah. was coming to the table. And if it hadn't been for Diane and Chewy, I would have probably been sitting there not able to Still eat not it. eating your soup. Um, yeah. yeah, it had so much potential, but it, it wasn't great. Yeah, I feel I feel bad recommending this place because the one I went to in Idaho was fantastic. This one, definitely not. The service was really poor and it was not busy in there. I my Coke, my Coke Zero, the, um, the syrup in it was terrible. It was yeah. awful. I left half of it. So it's cheap prices, but the food quality here, the service quality of this particular one, and apparently it's similar in, in lots of Orlando ones, but we're at the Winter Garden um, branch. The village one. The village, just not good at all. Um, most of our friends which left Which is a shame food. because you ran and raved and you were yeah. really excited about it, which is a shame, but most we tried. Of, most of our friends left their food. Um, there was a problem with uh, one of our friends, Bill, and did it, that was difficult to get sorted. Yep. It, yeah, just, just wasn't great. Um, I don't think I'll be back in a hurry. No. In, in Orlando, no, certainly. No. There's too many other choices. But you could, I mean, you might go to another one in Orlando that may actually be fine, you just don't know. But as it stands, I don't think we'd go back. Okay. Uh, when there's when there's this many other choices here, it, yeah. it's just it's just not worth it. So that is Cracker Barrel. Uh, we hope you've enjoyed this video. We'll be back next time with another one. Keep making memories. Catch you later.